Hey, welcome back to KC's Beer Room. It's time for another beer review. It's Friday night. Once again, we've made it through another week of fucking work. And what better way to top that off by having a beer. So these next, say, three beers are from a brewery in Kirawi, which is in the Sutherland Shire, called Sunday Road. I'll be doing their core range. Um, this one's their Blackwoods Pale Ale. They also do uh, a few others. They do the Coast Track Lager. They do an Enigma XPA. And the Over the Bridge Hazy Pale Ale, which I didn't get from them. I don't think. Cryotherapy Hazy IPA. And then they do a lot of other things. Coffee lagers, Viennas. And the rest. So I think what I got was obviously the American Pale Ale, the Coast Track Lager, and the Enigma XPA. Yeah, so three, two of each. That let's get into it it's 5.2 percent alcohol so it's get up there it says on the can at Sunday Road it's important to us that we create beers that embrace our way of life our amazing coastlines countryside and pristine produce it's about getting out enjoying it all and at the end of the day sitting back and appreciating the moment our beers are made up with an unwavering commitment to quality and flavour. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Independent brewery, 1.5 standard drinks. As usual, try not to drink so much when you're pregnant. They've got a brewery and a tap room in Kirawee in New South Wales, so check that out on their websites. It's a pale ale. So the colouring sh should be a light coloured straw, or straw coloured, I imagine. To me, that's got a slight bit of haze to it, just the slightest. It's not clear straight through. Looks fucking beautiful in that glass. It's holding its head very well. Nice little tight little bubbles in the froth. Smell. Yep, yeah, smells like beer. Not too strong on the nose. You could you probably smell a bit of fruitiness, a bit of malty, a bit of beer. We'll give it a go and see what it tastes like, eh? It's in a Blackwoods. I don't know what the Blackwoods is. We'll check that out soon and I'll let you know. But it's a pale ale. Everyone loves a pale ale. Right, I can taste in that. To me, straight away, it's got that earthy, piney, you know, that wood, that ruggedy, that rugged taste to it. Which to me, straight away, it's probably got American hops because they're the ones that give it that that resinous that resinous um, taste. Look at that! That's beautiful lacing on that glass. First big mouthful, top line. Little mouthful, second line. Beautiful. That's what you want to see, especially coming out of a can. That's like that's impressive. Pretty impressive Sunday road. Uh, quickly, just tell you a bit about what they say this beer is about. They're saying Blackwood, Blackwood's American Pale Ale, five point two percent. Blackwood's Beach is hidden gem and local favourite. All right, 
Never heard of it. Living down the Blue Mountains. No wonder I haven't heard of it. Like the beach, our pale ale is worth seeking out. It's all about the ingredients using heritage malts and multiple editions of American hops throughout the brew. A strong malt backbone, zesty citrus notes through the body, and a hoppy finish. This beer is a treasure. Yep, I agree, exactly. I've got the American hops, I can taste them. It's, um, yeah, strong malt backbone. Yeah, I agree with that. Zesty citrus notes through the body. Yeah, they're saying that shit, but that's, you know, all that means fucking absolute fucking rubbish. What you fucking really judge a beer on is price and availability and whether you like the taste of it. Uh, I haven't seen these in any bottle shops. I bought it online straight from there, but I think it cost me for the six pack with postage and handling. I think it was around, um, say, $35 for a six pack, which I guess isn't too bad. I think the postage was like 10 bucks, so really it was about 24 bucks for a six pack. Uh, so I quite enjoy this beer. I do like a I do like the American style, like the West Coast IPAs or the resiny, foresty type beer. So, you might be asking what this beer next door is. That is what I was drinking before this. Uh, that's the Four Pines India Summer Ale. So maybe next weekend we'll review that. But you can tell the difference between the, them two, how clear and hazy. So that this, this one is the Sunday Road. It, it is a bit hazy. It's not a hazy beer by name, but compared to the ale, the summer ale from Four Pines, that one is a lot, well, a little bit more hazy. So rating, I would give this, look, I'll give it a send it. I reckon like three or four of these will probably be enough before you decide to move on and drink something else. Uh, so I'll give it a send it out of five. We'll give it four, 4.1, 4.1 for the Sunday road. Blackwood's Pale Ale. Uh, so I'll be doing a few more. I'll get them out through the week for the rest of the Sunday road beers I've got. So till then, go to the eels, smash those panthers, and send it. Send it.